a team of professionals from various business sectors in Sweden, have joined forces together to form a business association with the aim of promoting businesses between Sweden and the West African sub-region. The organization, known as Sweden West Africa Business Association, SWABA, also aims at helping businesses to understand the cultural diversities in establishing new markets in West Africa. The chairman of the Sweden West African Business Association, Ajay Fukuo, says the initiative to start the association was born out of their own challenging experience in trying to establish a company in Ghana. Being Ghanaians originally, it was still a problem for us to establish without having the network. So we spent a couple of years trying to establish a network in Ghana so we can help other companies as well. Then we can use the network that we have created to help them get a faster entry to the market. Foucault says the goal of Swaba goes beyond helping businesses to establish in West Africa. The help to an organization is not only to help them establish. If the help is to help them avoid establishing something that will not work, that is also part of our goal. He highlights some of the business opportunities and advantages in establishing businesses in Africa. There are a lot of things that has been done here historically that can be done in Africa. And the cost of entering the market is much lower than the cost of doing the same thing here sometimes. So the growing market, the growing population is... Uh, big driver in this and is a big driver for companies to actually look into establishing in Africa. Euphrasi Agogolione, a board member of Swaba, says that the future is in Africa and that Swaba has come at the right time. We are starting at the right moment because the future is in Africa. The Chinese, for instance, have seized the opportunity. They have been there for years. When they go there, they think long term. Swedes are still a little bit slow in doing so, but I believe that with more and more information, like we just started doing today, that we are going to go far. So this is a good beginning. She expressed her feelings and hope that Sweden becomes part of the African dream. I start to feel like finally we are there or, you know, on the way there because things are happening in Africa and it will really be great to see Sweden as a part of that big African dream. Recently, the Ghana Union of Gothenburg, in collaboration with the Ghana Embassy in Denmark, organized a mobile consular services in Gothenburg. As part of their program, the board members of SWABA met the Ghana ambassador to present the association and also share the work of SWABA in promoting Ghana. Kwajo and Sampeodie, the General Secretary of SWABA, highlight some of the discussions they had with the ambassador. We discussed uh, a project, an EU project we are thinking of doing, uh, which has to do uh, with uh, having a vocational training <coughs> for uh, young people, young adults in Ghana that will lead to employment. Uh, she was very much interested in that. Uh, she mentioned a few institutions that we could contact. The ambassador, Her Excellency Amele Olenu Ewa Samoa, is impressed with what Swaba presented to her. She makes an assurance that the embassy is willing to support the activities of Swaba. We will ensure that we assist them in any way that we can. Yeah, that is why that is one of our priority areas. That is why we are there. We are there to go investors to Ghana, whatever support and assistance that we can give as a mission, we are going to do that. Nicholas Lusak, the internal auditor of SWABA, sees the outcome of the meeting with the ambassador as positive and a game changer. I think that uh, what's happening now is a game changer and I'm very happy to be part of it because uh, there are so many actions and I see so many positive outcomes. So I think that uh, it's happening now, yes. Swabe's so upcoming event is a collaboration with West Sweden Chamber of Commerce in a five-day market exploration trip to Ghana and Nigeria. The aim of the trip is to give a comprehensive overview of the markets and business opportunities available in these countries.
The outcome of today's meeting with the ambassador has increased the confidence of the board members of SWABA in their mission to promote businesses between Sweden and West Africa. Simon Boyan reporting.